Often people think of dance as being about creating an aesthetic or a particular shape. Part of doing the movement and doing the walks is about being embodied, that your body is part of who you are. It's something that you can trust and celebrate in the way that you understand and think. I've been here doing a project looking at the built environment and how choreographic thinking can open up ways of thinking about design and the built environment. I'm Adashola Akinle and I'm inviting you to respond to the moment of movement. The walk will have its own rhythm and pace. So you might not walk as far as me, or maybe you'll walk further than me, or maybe your walk will be something that you leave and come back to and leave and come back to. First of all, just thinking about some of the movements that you could do. There's playing with balance. Um, standing on one leg and seeing how your weight can move forwards and back. That gives you a sense of the texture of the ground that you're in, but also helps you notice what's around you. Another one is the idea of traveling, maybe moving quite quickly in your rhythm and then slowing down and changing direction, moving along something, repetition, back and forth, back and forth finding shapes and uh, seeing how you can intertwine with them, mirroring shapes that are far away from what you see in the moment that you're standing. And then also part of shape is the shadows around you as well, like seeing how your physical body fits into the shadows or what kind of shadow shapes you're making with your shadow body. Your dancing at the moment is about you using dance to understand the space and yourself more it's not about making a performance and everybody's experience brings a new meaning or a new facet to the meaning of being present in the campus. We invite you to share your own movement, a little, maybe a little video of some of your experience. Hashtag choreographing the campus.